Hello there, friends and followers. I have got a mini Shein haul for you. Um, I'm super excited because it is going to be mid-60s in Denver today. It is the beginning of April and I see spring and summer on the horizon and warm weather, uh, which I just love. <laughs> I'm from California and so winters are pretty tough for me here in Colorado because while there is a lot of sunshine, I am just sick of the cold, I'm sick of the snow, and it's around this time every year that I start getting so excited <laughs> for warm weather. And uh, yeah, so because of that, whenever I do my lingerie orders from Shein for my premium site, it's hard for me not to add at least a couple swimsuits and a couple dresses <laughs> because I just get so excited. So, um, yeah, it's a small one. I just added like three swimsuits and I think like three dresses, uh, just to have a little something to share with you guys and to get myself excited. Especially since, as I mentioned in the last video, we booked the trip to Jamaica. So, you know, you, I've said it once before, I'm pretty sure you can never have too many swimsuits. So. I'm so excited trying them on because it makes me very excited for Jamaica, which is still like eight weeks away, but still something to look forward to. So, you know, try the swimsuits on and get in the mood, get excited. So this is the first swimsuit. Um, I actually regret not getting this one for Cabo because this detailing here kind of reminds me of like Mexico and this actually probably would have been a great Cabo swimsuit, but I don't think I saw it on the website when I was ordering my swimsuits for Cabo, but it'll still work for Jamaica. Um, yeah, I think it fits really good. I love the high waist. Um, I think the pattern is really cute. Obviously, if I ever go back to Mexico, I'll be bringing this one for sure. But I'll also probably be bringing it to Jamaica. And I love the ruching. Um, yeah, I just love a white swimsuit. I love white and blacks. So I'm a big fan of the neutrals. I'm also a big fan of the florals, but it's um, neutrals, you know, you just can never go wrong with a neutral or have too many neutrals. So here is the first swimsuit. All right, first dress, it's a doozy. I'm a big fan. Um, love a floral as well. I don't know why. It's like maybe the girly girl in me, but uh, yeah, you're never going to get me out of the florals. I don't care if it goes out of style. <laughs> I'm still rocking the florals. And I love this dress. I think it's so cute. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I'm probably gonna wear this for Easter. I think it's a great Easter dress. And um, hopefully it's warm on Easter, I haven't checked. <laughs> but uh, you know, we're doing an Easter, going to an Easter brunch with the baby. It's gonna be so fun. And I think this will be the cutest little dress to wear to a little Easter brunch. So. Um, I really think it's cute. I like how it kind of has the, um, here, let me step back. It's kind of down. I don't even know what you would call this, but it's definitely higher up here towards the hips and a little lower there, like, so a triangle. Um, I think it makes it for really cute and then also kind of unique. I like how it's more form fitted through the midriff. It kind of reminds me of like a little corset and then, uh, yeah, cute little little bit of ruching at the boobs and this little tie. I am a big fan. Love this dress. Going to be wearing it a lot. And honestly, I think it looks really cute on. So, big fan. And uh, yeah, Easter outfit is planned. Let's check. <laughs> All right, so let's see what other dresses I have. Two more. And uh, yeah, let's keep getting excited. Excited for spring. Okay, as I mentioned, I am a girly girl, so it also should come as no surprise to you that pink is my favorite color. And uh, when I saw just like kind of a cute, plain pink dress, I was like, oh, that's perfect for me. And, uh, you know, will be perfect for me in spring and summer because I feel like, um, you know, last year I was pregnant, but this year just with uh, being a new mom, like, <laughs> it's just running errands and whatnot it's so easy to just throw something on that's comfortable quick not like putting together 
a whole uh, outfit because frankly, you're just exhausted. It's very tiring being, <laughs> being a new mom. You're not getting a lot of sleep and um, leaving the house with the baby, I can tell you, is like a whole ordeal. It's a whole production. You got to make sure he's fed, rested, so he's in a good mood. You got to make sure you got everything you can need. It's just a whole production. So the simpler you can make your wardrobe, but still feel cute, the better. And so I knew I was going to be a big fan of this dress because it's something that when it's 90 degrees out in Denver and you know I gotta run some errands with the babe it'll be super easy to just throw on and you know actually feel like kind of somewhat put together when you're out and about versus just like wearing like sweats or something you know so big fan of this dress I think it fits really cute I love that it's just a plain pink color still gives me the girly vibes that I'm looking for and yeah, it's going to be a staple for me this summer, I can already tell. Another cute dress that could also work is an Easter dress, the blue florals with the white. Um, I think very much is spring and Easter. I will admit it also <laughs> reminds me of Greece, <laughs> Santorini, and so I think like I love a blue and white pattern um, color palette. So I think maybe that's my subconscious telling me I wanna to go to Greece, maybe. Um, <laughs> Cause honestly, if I ever went to Greece, which yeah, I think at one day I probably will. It's been higher up on my bucket list. Um, I'm gonna be wearing all the blue and white. I don't care how, you know, nerdy or goofy it is. I just love blue and white as a color palette. And I think this is a super cute dress. Um, again, comfort is key, man. I am just at a point in my life where I just want to be comfortable, but I still want to look cute. So these dresses are checking all of the boxes for my needs, my wants, my desires. And honestly, I think they're still looking pretty cute. So I am so excited. <laughs> I'll say it again. So excited for warmer weather so that I can be rocking the dresses all the time feeling cute and yeah feeling comfy so Shein has some cute dresses for the plus sized sorry just saw one of my string of turtles on the floor I don't know how that got there probably one of those dogs hit it with their tail or something but um <laughs> uh yeah you know I'm a no surprise to you guys that I'm a plant lady. Uh, <laughs> anyways, yeah, big fan of the dress, the three dresses I got from Shein. This order, all successes, and I still actually have two swimsuits to share, so let's get to this. So this one, not terribly exciting, just a plain white swimsuit. Um, I will say what drew me towards this one is I like the kind of little bit of cup detailing here. There's an underwire. Um, so it does make it a little more kind of fitted and give it more of like, I guess, that bra look where it's got the, the very defined round bottom. Um, I will say I did size up knowing <laughs> larger breasts. That being said, I still think probably could have sized up one more size because um, given that it is the cup and the underwire, I don't feel like they fit in there super secure um i don't know sheen's policy on sending swimwear back so i might just have to rock it i do think that um it fits well down here so um this might just be one of those ones that um you know you just gotta be very careful when you're wearing it out and uh don't bend down or like if you do do it very slowly make sure everything stays put where it's meant to be um, yeah, I mean, I still think it's really cute. I honestly I probably also don't know if it's worth it to even go through the hassle of the exchange. So I'll probably just keep it, um, especially that it does fit nicely down here. And yeah, I think it's just a very cute, um, like basic white swimsuit with just a little bit of panaz, a little, little bow here. And yeah, uh, very cute. I think it'll be great for those beautiful blue beaches in Jamaica. Obviously, I'm excited. I love travel. Um, yeah, so still, still a fan of this one. And then one more 
very bright, very bright swimsuit. Um, I don't know why I get the, the bright ones because, you know, I wear them once and then I'm like, whoo, it's too bright for me. And then I donate them. So, uh, yeah, I'll wear it once, but I think it might be a little too bright for me. But let's check that one out. So I was pondering as I was putting this on. Um, I don't think it's bright that I have a problem with because I was thinking I do have a bright yellow swimsuit um, that I wore to Turks and Caicos. Uh, you can probably still find that on my Instagram, or I could probably put a picture in. And I refuse to let that one go because I love that one. I think it's just bright orange that I don't really like. Because, you know, that dress was kind of bright pink. So I just don't know why I keep getting bright orange swimsuits because I don't love bright orange, I think. Bright orange is just too, it's like, woo, like, maybe it reminds me of like a highlighter, I don't know. Which, the thought process doesn't make sense because I love the yellow one, but whatever. We all have our likes, we all have our dislikes. I think it looks cute, fits cute. Um, I like that it's got this little uh, tie here. I think you could tie it in the front or the back. Like I have it tied in the back, but I think you could probably um, tie it in the front too. Like, wait, hold on, let's wait. Tie it in the front. You know, I'd have to look at the mirror because I don't know what I'm doing. You could basically tie it however you want, front, back, side, any way you want. Um, it's long enough that you could have a longer bow or you could have a shorter bow, how I had it. So it's really a cute swimsuit. Um, if only we're just a different color, <laughs> you know? Even like purple would be cute, pink. I don't know if I like bright green, but yeah, I don't know, whatever. It is orange. I'm keeping it. I think it'll still be making for some cute photos, but... Um, not my favorite, I will say that. It's just not my favorite. Mainly due just to the color. I think it fits cute. Anyways, um, that was a very short Shein haul. I'm sure I'll probably be doing one more before Jamaica because who doesn't like to get more new swimwear? And as I mentioned, now that it's getting warmer, I'll probably start hanging out in the backyard more tanning. Um, you know, I don't hang out there now because everything's just so dead in Colorado in the winter. It's just, it's not enjoyable to look at. But once the trees start blooming and the flowers and all that, and I'm sure the baby will want to hang out outside once it's warmer. So I'll probably be actually spending a lot of my summer in swimwear and getting a good base tan. So, you know, it doesn't have to be only for vacation. It could be also for, I'm sure the, the baby will get a kiddie pool. So... You spend spend a lot of time in the swimsuits this this summer. I can already tell. Anyways, thank you for joining. Um, stay tuned for my next one. I gotta do an order. I'll have to see what I need. And yeah, we'll see you. Uh, we'll see you next time.